my YouTube channel English with Ira. So today we will learn how to describe yourself or anyone else. Before starting the topic, I would like to ask you a simple question. How would you describe yourself? How would you describe yourself? If this question seems difficult to answer, no problem. It's okay. I am here. Even native speakers find it difficult to answer these types of questions that how you will describe yourself. Describing yourself is just like telling people what you are, how you look like, your behavior, your emotions and all that. What are your characteristics, what are your traits and all this. If someone asks you to describe your friend, brother, sister, don't be confused if your friend is like beha uh, is behaving like a boss he has leadership qualities so how will you describe that he is bossy okay so here are some words which will help you to describe yourself or anyone else so let us begin with the first one a person who behaves suitable in every situation he doesn't get nervous panic that person is called classy. He is classy means he behaves normally in every situation no matter how difficult it is. Second, sympathetic. Sympathetic is the person who understands and cares about people's feelings, people's emotions. Third, cookie. Cookie. Person who is little crazy. Not like that way in bad way, in funny way, who tries to make people laugh. And in fact, the world need the most today. Cookie. Okay. Fourth word. Sly. Sly is a person who is very clever, who has very cunning nature, like a fox. Okay. Fifth word. Quick with it. Quick with it.
lone bird two we can say lone wolf or lone bird a person who prefers his own company person means you can say he is up to his only okay does not like socializing himself telling each and everybody about himself no person he, who enjoys his own company lone we can say alone hum alone word use karte hai na ki jisko akela rehna pasand hota hai so lone lone wolf means person who is happy with himself only 15 and of course the last word cold fish cold fish is the word used for a person who has very little emotions who is very you can say unfriendly means he doesn't share his feelings with everybody he does not like himself to be surrounded by people so describing yourself or anyone else this topic is completed i have told you fifteen words that we use that we can use to describe anyone else or ourselves so i hope you like my video and i hope you gain information if you find it informative please like share subscribe my channel and click on the bell icon for the latest updates and tell me in the comment section that on which topic you want me to make the next video so i have done two lots of effort making in making this video so my like game